Governor Doug Ducey says students at Arizona's three public universities will not be required to get the COVID vaccine to come back to class in person this fall. News 4 Tucson's Eric Fink joins us live on campus tonight with the latest. Eric. Hi there, Amanda John. The governor's executive order is stemming from a policy that was created by ASU President Michael Crow and his team for the fall semester that says when students come back to class at Arizona State this fall, they are expected to be vaccinated. Now, up at ASU, you could still take in-person classes without getting the vaccine as long as you mask up, get tested for COVID twice a week, and do daily health checks. Now, Governor Ducey thinks that goes too far. He says we need to keep the vaccine a choice. The executive order today says students can't be mandated to get the vaccine or hand over vaccination documents. They also can't be required to be tested or wear masks on campus. A little while ago, I spoke with a U of A journalism professor and I asked whether or not this decision from the governor gives her pause about coming back to teach on campus here at the U of A. All of these things give me pause for going back on campus. I want to go to a campus that is as safe as possible. And that would mean having students be vaccinated and having staff and faculty be vaccinated. I just, it's really disappointing to see this becoming politicized when this is a public health issue. And this afternoon, the university leaders here on campus responding to the governor's executive order with this statement, quote, we will comply with the governor's executive order and continue to monitor our public health conditions to help ensure the health and well-being of our students, faculty and staff. And we're going to have a lot more on this story coming up tonight at 10 o'clock. We've got you covered live for now from the campus of the U of A. I'm Eric Fink, News 4 Tucson.